Hi everyone, we're here live today visiting Red Arrow. This is um, Kelsey and Amanda. We were just joking before, so that's why I saw it. Um, and they're a clothing boutique, small business, and we wanted to kind of see the behind the scenes of what it takes to run a small business clothing boutique. So, um, Kelsey, why don't you go ahead and tell us how it all began? So we actually started with a storefront in Moab, Utah, and we had so much fun doing that, but it became really hard traveling from Salt Lake City to Moab with two kids. So we decided to, to close that down and um, phase it out. And what we ended up doing is we, we, were, we weren't really planning on opening up another store, but our family and friends were asking us to get like, if we could help them buy beanies for discounts and for a cheaper price, because that's what we offered in Moab. We offered a really good price on there. And so we actually, CC beanies are what started our whole like, our whole new phase and what we are now. So we, we found some discounted beanies and we sent out a text to a couple of our family and friends and just to see if we could get a couple orders and we ended up being really successful with that. We, we had hundreds of orders. And so we realized at that point that we, people want a good deal. And so that's kind of what, how we started our new phase of Red Arrow. We offer, we, offer, we still do, offer really good discounts on name brand and popular items and cheaper than you can find anywhere else. And that's kind of our goal, is to help you feel beautiful at a really good price. Nice, that, that's something that I think we can all in, enjoy and afford, and, and that's probably hitting like all of the targets that everybody looks for. Um, so as you have started this business and you've been really successful and you're opening, oh, and I forgot to mention also your, um, the way that they're different is so cool and unique that they're a boutique that carries the clothes to you. Yeah. They have a trailer. You want to tell them about that? Yeah, we have a traveling boutique as well as online. Um, basically, it's like a boutique in the trailer. So we redid the whole trailer, the flooring, the walls, the lights. There's a dressing room inside. Um, it's super, super cute. We started getting a lot of sales online, but we had a lot of people who wanted to know what it felt like when they tried it on and how it would fit. So that kind of helped the idea to add the fashion on wheels idea where we travel like boot trucks would and we post our locations on our website and on our social media for people to come and follow us and, and get some cute stuff. Nice, so you're, you're, you want to be flexible. That's a really good um, business model is to be flexible and be where the people want to um, see the product and, and, and get it in an in a efficient way as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so the next thing that we talk about is um, what's the hardest thing? You know, we're, we work with small business owners and what's the hardest thing that, um, that maybe has come across your, your plate as far as being a business owner? Well, I think the hardest thing for us was finding the right vendors that carried the right um, quality of clothing. It took us a really long time to find um, the right material where, you know, you'd wash it and it would still be wonderful and we'd get returning customers. So that took a long time, um, meeting vendors, going to shows, doing everything we possibly could to find the right styles and we finally found that and we love our stuff. Nice. Yeah, that's wonderful. And you guys are a family-like business also? Yes, so it's the two of us, which we're sister-in-law, so we're married, we married in the family. Okay. Um, and then our mother-in-law. In <laughs> yes. And then our mother-in-law, um, Laurie Williamson, who couldn't be here today with us, but um, we married her sons. Okay. And then the boys also help with some of the labor and things in the company. And They're very supportive. They're very supportive and yeah. very, very helpful. Um, so yeah, it's definitely a good family business. Nice. I love that. I was reading an article that just came to my mind about women business owners and how um, the number one struggle for them is family support. And I feel like um, when you have good family support, then it makes it all worthwhile. Yeah. Being able to make everything work at the same time. So um, Gerber Business Solutions has a theme for the month of April, and we're introducing that a little bit early today because we have this wonderful um, spotlight here that we're doing. And um, the theme for April is confidence boosters. So if you're a business owner or even if in your personal life you have a little bit of a struggle 
boosting your confidence. Um, we wanted to ask this um, successful uh, clothing company what kinds of things they can do to help us understand what can be better for our um, confidence boosting. So well, that's what we strive for. We strive to make everybody feel beautiful, whether you're a small or 3X. We carry all sizes, we carry all styles, main brand, popular, whatever you can think of, we have it so that you guys can feel beautiful. And we, we keep that at a price that you guys can afford and so that you can get multiple items versus just like one top or two tops. You can get a whole outfit and feel beautiful and confident. Yeah, and with that being said as well, um, it's really important to us for all women to feel beautiful and know that they are, you know, um, wonderful on the inside and out, but that also they can't look at somebody in a small size wearing that thinking I could never wear that because you absolutely could. Um, so that's one of our really, really big things that we love is that we have a lot of plus size people who really, really love our clothing. Um, we'll offer, for instance, you know, this sweater in a small, but also up to three X. But the other thing about that is we do not charge more for the plus sizing. Even though the fabrics and materials are more expensive for us to do, we still keep the prices the exact same. Um, just because we don't feel that we should charge more for it, it should all be the same. Yeah, and that, that speaks to your values, the values of the company and the mission statement. I feel like that's something that kind of goes back to the um, – the origination of the company is this value that you have for making sure all people feel beautiful and um, that that sacrifice in the price that that can hurt but to make sure that um, that's a that's a big deal to your customers and that that really means a lot to them I'm sure too yeah so. <laughs> um, okay so now is the fun part also we get to get to know them a little bit get to know their story and they're going to show us a sneak peek of um, something that they're doing a photo shoot on later today, um, some clothing that has never been seen yet. And so why don't you go ahead and show us this okay. little surprise here. So I have two of our newest favorite items. We've each picked out an item. And this is my personal favorite. It has ruffles all across the front. It's so beautiful and so flowy. And one of my favorite things to do is to tuck the side into your pants. It just adds so much, so much extra pizzazz. I don't know, I love it, it's so cute. Yeah. Um, and then the other one that finally arrived is my favorite and it's um, it has like the flared sleeves kind of the ruffle but it's like so cute on you can't even imagine um, it's also like not super long but it's not too short so it's perfect length with your jeans and then if you have like the high waist jeans it's even cuter and then also how she said to tuck it in it looks really cute when you tuck the front or if you like tuck the side mm -hmm. really cute. wonderful <laughs> awesome so, um, last but not least, how can people um, how can people find you guys? Where are you located, and how do they get to know you better? So you can find us online at redarrowclothing.com. You can also find our locations online if you go to our locations tab. And we're also located on Facebook and Instagram at red-arrow-deals. Nice. Okay, and. The sneak peek, or the sneak peek, the, uh, the promo that you guys are offering, you were telling us all about it. I'm so excited. You guys get to hear about it here first today. Let's, let's hear what that promo is for those that have viewed this today. So we're going to do um, one of our special ones that we do once in a while. We haven't done it for a long months, time. Yeah, like. yeah, we've got um, a lot of requests for it. We have, but we've just been kind of waiting for all of our new stuff for spring to come in. Um, and stay tuned because we have a few more things coming in um, in the next day or two. Anyways, today, um, throughout, how long is this going for? Let's do I say the next, let's do the next week since we have all the stuff coming. <laughs> yeah, true so small the next seven, seven days. I <laughs> sure, love it. <laughs> um, so the next seven days, we're offering buy three items, get one free. So basically, buy three, get the fourth free at any price, so it doesn't matter, it's just the lower price item. So if you're getting four items at $20, then one of them will end up being free. Um, and Kelsey has that code for you. Oh gosh, <laughs> let's do Gerber, buy, buy three, get what? Yeah, let's do Gerber, Gerber three, three, one. Nice, <laughs> awesome. Okay, well, um, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below. Um, we'll leave this up 
uh, throughout the remainder, and Red Arrow will be um, uh, watching it as well. So let us know if you have any questions, and get to know Red Arrow. They're coming uh, with their trailer to different locations, so check their website for those locations as well, so you can um, go and see and touch and feel and go to their website so you can get a preview of that as well. Thanks so much, everybody, and thank you so much for this interview today. This was really awesome. Thank you. They're great. Really <laughs> awesome.